I give you a bit of a hand? You put your foot on top of my foot. Put your foot. Push my foot down. Go on. And again. Ready? And again. And again. Go on. Go on. Push my foot down. Go on. Yeah. Stamp on my foot really hard. And again. Go on. To celebrate the launch of UCLan NASA High Sea Mission, the University of Lancaster joined forces with NASA to help create a new world record for the most water-powered bottle rockets to be launched within a 24-hour period. Here at Tiverton High School, the science department got involved and invited pupils from across the town to come and take part in this record-breaking day. Yeah, we've had uh, uh, St John's Primary School and uh, Castle yeah. Primary School hoping for Heathcote yeah. in a little while and uh, I've, uh, we've, we've launched with uh, a year 8 class and two year 9 classes. How's it going so far? Is it looking like you're going to be getting quite a few hundred? I think we're making a good contribution to the actual world record. Why did you decide to take it and bring it down here? Uh, it was just a, a golden opportunity, saw uh, a link on a website somewhere and followed it and thought, what a bit of fun. Pupils had to battle against heavy rain in their bid to set a world record, which was recorded by students and independent witnesses were also called in to certify the school's achievement. As well as being a world record, the day also proved to be a lot of fun for those taking part. Go! Give us a good smile. Well, it was quite hard because it's you have to do it really hard to let it explode. How hard was it exactly? It was really hard for me because I'm not really strong enough to do it again. And how high did it go and where did they end up? Mine went really high and it went over two roofs. Really? <laughs> mine, mine fell in the bike shed. I had to pump quite a lot of time. Really? How long did it take to get it up in the air? Just quite a bit of a long time. Really? And how high did it go? Very high. When I found it, it, went, it flied all the way. How high did it go? Uh, really high up. Really high up. It's quite fun. <laughs> it's really fun. It just like kept going like that on the pump and then it just went boom. <laughs> mine went the highest. Yeah, mine kind of just flipped over a meter. Mine away. went like, up there and made that hole in the crowd. And how does it feel to be part of a world record? I don't think it's very achievable, really. No, I think it's pretty good because, like, well, we're not going to get a picture in a book, are we? Yeah, but if we didn't, if we didn't, be if we didn't do it, then there would be like really low amount, and they wouldn't have broken. Yeah, if we didn't do it, then there wouldn't be a record for a yeah. big piece of water going up in the air in a plastic bottle. That would be a shame for everyone. You're so pessimistic. <laughs> <laughs> Students weren't the only ones taking part, with primary school teachers getting involved too. My name's Sally, number 24. Yeah. Right. Right, when was that? Okay. Oh, it's not as hard as I thought. It's hard for children, but it's pumping. Here we go then. How many pumps do you think it'll take? Uh, probably ten. Ten. I've done about five. Three? Have I only done three? It's harder than I thought. Woo! <laughs> oh my goodness me! That, that was, came as a, that, bit of a surprise. That wasn't was it? a shock. I was expecting to pump a bit more. Okay, 
Kirsty Singleton, 25. Oh my goodness, it's really hard. It's a lot harder than you'd think it would be. Ugh. And really muddy. Oh. There it goes. I think the children have all enjoyed themselves today. Yeah, they've really had such a great time. It's been a great experience coming down and um, having the opportunity to do this with the commute with the high school and in the local community. And of course, being part of a what could be a world record. Hopefully, fingers crossed. <laughs> <laughs> Come the end of the school day at 3.30 and after four hours, over a hundred bottle rockets had been launched and Tiverton had done its bit for this world record attempt. And for more information on the record, visit the website via the link shown on screen. Lewis Clark, for Lose News, at Tiverton High School. Yeah. Oh, I don't know whether that's a quick one or a slow one yet. That's, that's a quick one.